What is going on, guys? Welcome back for another episode of Iron Throne. Yes. All right. So we're progressing nicely on the game, getting some, uh, getting some good power, uh, getting some good VIP, getting some good Lord levels, getting some good everything, guys. But first and foremost, definitely want to thank everyone that made everything possible. Uh, we just hit 5,000 subscribers uh, yesterday, and I'm very gracious and thankful for that, guys. So thank you so much, guys. Thank you. All right. So. We made an alliance a couple days ago, and it's coming along. We got a couple people that just joined up, and I had no idea that so much goes into an alliance. I knew there was a lot, but I didn't know so much was in doing an alliance. So I definitely want to um, thank everyone that joined. We got two people so far. We had like a, I think like four, or five, but you know how it goes. But it's all good. Either way, it's all it's a good thing. All right, so right now we have UTB Consecration. That is the name of the alliance. Okay, so we have Alliance Power is 6,982,276. Uh, we are ranked 276 or 267. Uh, gift level is level 1. English and we are public. All right, so let's just see if there's, any, there's no gifts right now. But we're about to make some gifts. All right, so we have different tabs we can go through, guys. We have War, which there's no war right now. We were just attacked not too long ago. We had three guys that were attacking from, I forgot their name, but I can look them up. Uh, we could do our research right now. We're doing research to architecture. It still has 8 hours, 36 minutes, and 24 seconds. We can actually speed that up with other people in the Alliance. So that's another thing we can do there. We can speed it up that way. But it's not too, it's not too uh, necessary that we need it right now. So we can wait that out. Uh, right now we're doing uh, Cornucopia. So we're just going to donate some resources there. We've been donating resources there. Then we have Territory. All right, so we have Alliance Castle, Defense Facilities, Resource Center, and Special. Resource Center is going to give us the Alliance Farm, Lumber Yard, Alliance Quarry, Iron Mine, and Silver Mine. Now, the good thing about having these actual buildings right here is that you're, 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 whenever you do your mining, you're actually safe. As opposed to going out on the world and doing some farming, you're going to get attacked. And they can, they can hit your nodes and stuff like that. You can tile, they, they call it tile hitting. Uh, you can get tile hit that way. But doing it at the Alliance Centers, you, you can't be. Or Resource Centers, you can't you know, attack. So we need to get some uh, get some of these things put down. So definitely, I think that before we can put anything down, we have to put down the Alliance Castle. Can't put anything down unless the castle is uh, put down. And we don't have enough members. Let's, let's see, Resource. So I don't know how many members we need. Probably like five, maybe? I don't know. Something like that. But it's all good. We'll get it at some point. We got the Lion Shop. You guys can always uh, purchase some items here. It's pretty exciting. Iron production booths. Speed ups. You got the catalog. You got the food. All kind of different stuff in here. So Alliance Points is 60, uh, 67,625 we have right now. So as we, get more, as we get more people in the Alliance, we'll get more stuff as well. Points obtained. It's the point statistics. Let you know who's doing what. Purchase history. So if we purchase some, any of these little alliance uh, nodes and everything like that. Nodes, but the uh, use any points, it'll show up here. Whew, I'm out of breath today, guys. All right, so we got the Alliance Wyvern. will empower the troops it accompanies. So an Alliance castle is required to donate resources. So we don't have the castle yet because we don't have enough people. If you guys are looking for an alliance, the UTB consecration is always recruiting. We don't worry about your power. The only thing we ask is that you guys are active. You don't have to play every single day. I understand life happens, but just be active, you know, at a fair amount, which, you know, every other day at least. <clears throat> uh, we got dragon skills too. I forgot about that. I didn't see that one. Got the dragon skills. Scripture ages. So once we get this going, then I'll be able to go make a video on that. It will go through it all. Um, help Alliance. Got the people that need help. That's me. Supply Alliance. If you want to go ahead and donate some uh, some help or leave resources, you can always send your Alliance members some resources to help them along. You got the members. You can either promote from here. You can demote from here. You can kick out from here. Alliance Mail. If you want to send Alliance mail to everybody instead of just putting it in the chat, because if you do it in the chat, there's a chance that if someone didn't log on for like, let's say, six hours, 12 hours, whatever, they might miss that particular chat. So you want to do Alliance mail, so that's guaranteed that everybody's going to see that particular thing there. 
Then you have your alliance board where you can chat with everybody there. There's just too many different ways you can chat. Um, you got the details. Um, for power, it just lets you know everyone's power here. Stats, battle one. We lost 625 because we just got attacked. And I just actually spent to get my stuff, my troops back. I lost about maybe 5 million power. No, not 5 million power. 500,000 power, I think it was. But I got it back. It's all good. I'm not worried about that. And then we got the alliance management here. This is where you can actually check the profile. You can edit the, I guess the, you can probably edit the name. Oh, you can. Nice. The tag, you can do the uh, name, tag, and all that good stuff right there. Um, you got the elders. Eight members of the alliance with the highest contribution will be automatically selected as elders each week. The following condition must be met in order to for elders to be chosen. Uh, you don't have enough members for elders to be chosen. 15 members are required for elders to be chosen. So I guess we need 15 members to do anything. Okay, guys. Please make it happen. Uh, diplomacy. Build up a trust in becoming a friendly alliance. Um, build up trust by a company... Alliance, let's register. Build up trust by becoming a friendly alliance. So I guess we can always register to do that. And you can pick the alliance that you want to pick. Register as friendly. You can leave your alliance. If you leave alliance, all unopened alliance gifts will be removed. Yada yada yada. I can appoint a leader. I can just tell one point one of these two guys here to be a leader. Which I wouldn't mind anyone doing a leader. I'm not really I don't see myself as an alliance leader. That definitely would help out. And that's pretty much it as far as the alliance goes. It's a lot of good, a lot of good stuff here. Oh, we can actually invite people. So anyone that doesn't have any power or any any alliance, you can just go through here and invite these guys here. I guess. Let's do that. Let's invite these guys. This is my blind mind doing it. Blind invites. I'll do it. I don't mind. Use law of average here. We're gonna at least get one. We'll do probably like 20 invites. We'll get at least one. Now will they stick? Who knows? We get some experience. Some non-experienced people. It doesn't matter to me either way. Just want some people, period. Gotta get some warm bodies in the house, guys. Alright, so manage invites. So we invited a lot of people. So like I said, we may get like one out of that entire bunch. That may join up. And I'm cool with whatever. It doesn't really matter to me, guys. I'm, I'm cool with whatever. I'm pretty easy going. Let's look at our mail here. Because I know we got attacked. Look at it. 633 times? Come on. That's a lot. BRA. So that's our... I guess that's going to be our enemies. I guess. So I need to be diplomatic. And uh, grab some other... Some alliance here. Some, uh, some friendlies here. I had to put a peace shield up. That's how bad it was. Our hero was captured. No, get my hero back. Give me back my hero. Maybe they may really release it back. I don't know. I do need my hero back though. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I'm missing the hero, guys. Not a good feeling. <laughs> But it's all fun though. But I want my hero back, guys. So if you stole my hero, you better bring him back. Or else. Period. I'll leave it at that. Alright, so we definitely need to get some heroes leveled up here. I got everyone pretty much up to 30 almost. As close to 30 as I can. Except these last two we just got. We just got Haral. And we got Um Toma. That's pretty much it, guys. Yeah, that wraps up this episode for the Alliance here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys are looking for an alliance, UTB Consecration is definitely recruiting. Uh, there's no stipulations, just be active. And that's pretty much it, guys. But all that being said, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next episode. Peace.